Hello guys, it's me Z from Wireless Solution and today we are going to work on the new Samsung Galaxy A21 how to Google bypass the phone but just to make sure for this purpose what we are going to do is uh, <coughs> we are uh, letting you let me show you first that where we are going to so once you come here connect to Wi-Fi make sure um, it will take a few moments to get to the screen okay dokie. okay so now you can see that this device was being reset so what we are going to do for this purpose make sure you have uh, your own sim card you can put it in another phone and put a lock on it and what we are going to do once you click on there you can see the setting once you click on the setting then go back uh, swipe and touch uh, touch and feedbacks now sound and vibration and once you are in sound and vibration ringtones and you can see the upper right corner there is a plus sign and then hit search so most of the people once they come here they cannot get the swipe screen from the bottom it's because if you try this once and you failed it and you want to do it again make sure turn the phone off and then turn it back on and then repeat the process so um, if you fail once it will never happen again so in this process what you are going to do put the lock sim card in the phone a time you put the in and then tap it continuously <clears throat> and then what you are going to do just remove the sim card and hit ok now swipe this to the side click on this one press and hold this to the bottom what you are going to do press and hold the turn the bluetooth on mm, ok as I told you right if we are going to do the same process again let me show you that putting this again and pressing this it will not gonna work <clears throat> now you see it's not working because we tried it once so what we are going to do is just power off the phone leave it for a few seconds and then you are going to power on the phone so you are going to uh, do this process again and again unless it's make you it let you do it one fail attempt power off the phone and then power back on uh, if you want to do it again and again without power recycling it will not letting you the second time it will just pop up on the mic screen and that's all now once we are here we are going to repeat the whole process again Okay, let's do it again. Then swipe it down, press the Bluetooth so it can turn on. Wait for the Bluetooth to be turned on. Make sure you have the newer Bluetooth version.
Come on. You can see that the Bluetooth is on. Now what you are going to do, make sure you are you have the newest Bluetooth version that is 5 and up. Now press and hold it. We are going to turn it on. I'll hit scan. Okay, this is the Bluetooth we have here. This is the Bluetooth. <coughs> okay, now it's pair. Okay. Now let it be paired for a few moments. What you're going to do is press the... Uh, normally you take calls and drop calls on he from here in the Bluetooth. So what we are going to do, you need to click this like three times it will not work and then try it again you will keep trying unless you get the voice come on Come on. Okay, you got it. Okay, see so here what you are going to do is You just press this one and type, say, Walmart. Okay, now you say Walmart, come down to the bottom of the screen and hit direction. Once you are in here, so just skip. By the way, I'm surpri surprised too because I didn't restart the phone and the second time I attempt it works. So that's something uh, new that I never tried before. I tried before, but it never worked like that, you know. So now when you are here, what you are going to do, click on the mic and say open Google, okay? Open Google. Open Google. Okay, why it's not working? Uh oh. Open Google. Opening Google. Okay. So now we don't need this and no thanks now here when you come here you will type setting so once you come to the setting here click on the setting 
go down you will see biometrics and security now once you come here uh, fingerprints or face recognition anything you want to put I will put fingerprint now in the fingerprint or instead of that do the other security setting go down and it will tell you pin window off so turn it on click on this one and then use screen lock to unpin you will this do this one and then just uh, what you're gonna do is put a new pin let's for example we are going to put one 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 okay now what you're gonna do is simply restart the phone we don't need this anymore so I'm going to turn it off now it will take few seconds to power on the phone Okay, so once you swipe the screen, it we put the pin one 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 one. Click OK. Then hit next. Next, you are already connected to Wi-Fi. So it will take a few seconds for this to be installing the update or checking for update to install. So let's see where it goes from there. Now we put the pin 1111. Now hit next. Now skip skip it anyways just a simple process and here the phone is already being unlocked okay thank you so much guys see you in next video have a nice one enjoy your time